people opposed to President Trump's plans for infrastructure and his presidency in general were out protesting his visit today. They say our tax money is already spent on infrastructure and large highway projects should not be paid for with user fees and tolls or should be. Not on your side, reporter Jay Warren is live along Kellogg Avenue for us with what it looked like out there, Jay. Yeah, so there were about 80 or so protesters, protesters today from various groups and organizations. But again, as you say, one common thread, their opposition to President Donald Trump. They started at a nearby park in Columbia, Tusculum, and then walked about a mile and a half down here close to the entrance to uh, Rivertown Marina. Now, they fear that the uh, Trump's ideas for public-private partnerships will privatize various projects which will then result in tollways and other user fees so that corporations will profit from what they feel, again, should be paid for by tax dollars. Additionally, from the Trump team's ties to Russia, to women's reproductive rights, to what they felt was an assault on the separation of church and state, everything was on the table for those marching against the president today. Privatizing the roads um, is going to lead to us having little toll roads everywhere and toll bridges. Um, we're already paying taxes, that's what our taxes are for, is for building roads and infrastructure and selling it off is just going to put uh, money into the uh, big corporate hand. Now today's protesters also fear that some of these things could re result in environmental rollbacks, but of course one very important to point to point out is that there isn't an infrastructure bill yet, so there are no details to even examine at this point. Jay Warren, 9 on your side, Kellogg Avenue.